Hello there, my name's Mike and I'm the Science Guy Education Coordinator here at WGVU. And for a few moments in science today, we're gonna to talk about Bernoulli's principle. Faster air moves, the less pressure that's created. Basically, moving air, lower pressure, all right? And I'm gonna take two pop cans with a straw and I'm just gonna simply blow between those cans. And as I do, I'm creating less pressure where that straw is, greater air pressure on the outside is gonna push those cans together, all right? Here we go. Less pressure where I'm blowing between the cans, greater air pressure on the outside is gonna force those together. All right, let's do that one more time. All right, so that's one way you can look at Bernoulli's principle. All right, so we're gonna use something called Bernoulli's bag, and it's just a thin bag, all right, small bag. And I'm gonna blow as much air into this as I can to fill it up. And you may think, how many breaths does it take for you know, me to do that? Well, if I blow into it like this, it's gonna take, it's gonna take quite a few breaths to fill up that whole bag. So instead, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna use Bernoulli's principle and move that air faster. So what I'm gonna do is blow air into the middle of that bag so that I have less pressure where I'm blowing into that bag, moving air. Greater air pressure is gonna force into the bag, causing it to fill up a lot faster. So here we go. All right, and what I get is Bernoulli's bag with a whole lot of less breath than what I did with the first time. Thank you for watching A Few Moments in Science with Bernoulli's Principle.